Hey, drink, drink that water. Don't drink that water, girl. I told you. Okay, we're live, Timmy. <laughs> Good All morning, right. little Timmy. Talking that shit. <laughs> Good morning. We are live as fuck. And you talking about Katrina piss. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we do, y'all. It's too early for this shit. Too early. Good yeah, morning. This is the most unprepared, prepared show What's ever. What's up, Timmy? What's up, nigga? What's up, dude? What's up? What's up, yo? What's up, nigga? I miss you, boys. We here. Yeah, I miss you, too. You down, you down um, there in New Orleans. You down in New Orleans, baby. I'm down in New Orleans, baby. It's Nola, baby. Oh, huh? I went down there. New Orleans is the nicest, dirtiest place I've ever fucking been. I'm sorry, I said it. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> but don't, 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 don't you love it when they talk to you in that accent and that hospitality just come up? Oh, no, you want, oh, you no. want some more, baby, baby? If you go down on Bourbon Street, they got all you want down there, baby. <laughs> well, can I have yeah, no one thing, bro? Everything down in New Orleans is gumbo. I, I don't want a gum. I, fuck you, want gumbo for breakfast? I don't want gumbo for breakfast. It's true, man. It is so true. So what y'all been doing? I haven't seen y'all. Good morning, Leisha. Welcome to the party. What's up, Leisha? Good morning. Good morning. We miss you. We're coming back. Hey, Leisha. Huh? Yeah, we've been uh, yeah, been, you know, I've been busy working and doing other stuff. You know, Look at my nose busy. Over. What the hell is that? Oh, you got Spider-Man? What the bitch, what are you, Spider-Man? Avengers? Huh? Get Christy love. <laughs> that shit like a, that's like, that's, that's like a big-ass medical alert bracelet. <laughs> no I got baby. diabetes. I got high blood pressure. Help me. Help me. Help me. <laughs> y'all are stupid. I hate y'all. I really hate y'all, man. What you been up to, Timmy? Where you been? Huh? I've been in uh, I've been in New York for a minute. I'm back now. Okay. Okay. Just, uh, hanging out in New York, just doing things in New York, but I'm back now. Good morning, uh, Rosalind. Welcome to the party. Hey, Rosalind. Good morning, all my ladies, ladies, ladies. Oh. oh. <laughs> This nigga, this nigga been back at the gym for three days. <laughs> Jell is back. Okay. You, know going, you know that's where I'm going as soon as we finish. That's what exactly where I'm going. Okay. Hey, man. You got to get hey, back to I, I, I just joined Brick Body's gym. These white girls is winning. Brick Body. <laughs> hey. hey. Hey man, they done learned the tech, they done learned the squat techniques, they done they done learned what to do. Nigga, these white girls, I went to brick by I, I went to I would find me a co-signer. I'm gonna find me a co-signer. <laughs> See, you pulling up to the club in the new whip at the show at the show on the 18th, right? The show on the 18th, you're yeah, gonna pull up in the new whip. That's right. <laughs> at at the city winery. Yes, right in DC. Me and my new, my whip and my, my whip and my white chick. Me and my white chick and my new whip. <laughs> and then August the thirtieth, we don't have a whole lineup lock yet, but we do know uh, August the first is canceled, and August the thirtieth is the new date. It's going to be just jokes and notes. So far, we got Timmy Hall, little Timmy Hall. Hey, hey, Timmy, go be in the building. We have Jess Niche out of hey, Chicago. Timmy. Hey, 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 just niche in the building. <laughs> and we got uh, some others that we can't say yet. Good morning, Jamal. Welcome to be, the party. I'm going to be in the building. I'm going to say something. I'm going to say something on the mic. It may not be oh, funny. Yeah, 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 We're going to yeah, say yeah. ladies, 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 Take your shirt off, y'all. Let me see your great shirt. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, Nikki, make a chest like a trunk board. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, he got some that. Okay, so y'all need to get y'all tickets today for next week, though. Next week. The 18th, baby. The 18th. Big Dale in the house. Lady, lady, lady. Yeah, we're going to be in there. Alcar, Candace August, and headlining Freddie Ricks. 
Frederick I'll is, be there. is Come on, hang out with us. The mouth gonna be in the bed. I'm gonna let y'all see what that mouth do. What that mouth do. I'm gonna let you see what that mouth do. I will be in the house. Nikki, make sure you know I'll be there. I will be there. Can you host? Can you host this one? I sure can. All right, little Timmy, come on through and host and get this thing started. So y'all going to have the whole It's Too Early for This Shit crew. That's next yeah. Thursday, August 8th. I mean, July 18th. How much tickets? $20. That's yes. it. That's all. That's man, all. Y'all better go and get them tickets, man. Go and get your two or three. Bring yeah. your mama and your grandmama with you. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out why the fuck my whole head ain't in this goddamn thing. It's little as fuck. We see your whole head. Yeah, all the first is canceled. Sorry. I will uh, put you on another date, Jamon. Okay. So let me see what we talk about today, y'all. Because I saw something one o'clock in the morning. Y'all be texting me one o'clock. Timmy says (laughs) at one o'clock in the morning. Why? This is going to be a city winery, Alicia. This be City Rewinery. So y'all know uh, R&B singer Kiki White is pregnant again. Again? Pregnant Let's again. Give it, give it, baby. Did he got any ovaries left? Baby makes 10, man. This girl is really fertile. She she is going all the way back to, I don't know, uh, like in the old, olden days when people were having like hundreds of babies and shit. Ain't nobody doing that I love her too. millennium. Ain't no way I better be more. Ten with her third husband. Kiki is having another baby. I know everything in her coochie just drops right on out. Oh, I, I met her before. And she she's a good she crazy as fuck. She just how she met me. Hi, my name's Kiki. I said, Oh, that bitch she's got super, good pussy. She's super oh, sexy. She good pussy. The crazy you are, the better the sex. That bitch pussy is delicious. Oh, oh my God. God. Hey, 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 I, I've been wanting to holler at her for a long time. I think hey, she's hey, she hey, sexy with mother. The crazier, the yeah. better that she's shit is. Oh, oh, wonderful. And that Southern accent, you know, I'm from the South. That Southern accent drive me crazy. And yeah. she can sing to me. Yeah, she can sing. That girl, And she got man. a big booty. Oh, I know what I'm about to ask. like, hi, I'm Kiki. <laughs> oh, she's in love. I'm in love. <laughs> But she's so flirted. I'm, she's so flirted. I'm gonna take a Plan B pill before I fuck her. <laughs> <laughs> we both putting condoms on. <laughs> <laughs> you dumb as hell. Nigga, look, nigga, I ain't coming on. If I when I come, I'm putting that shit in the toilet. I'm just running to the bathroom. Yeah! <laughs> ain't coming nowhere near Kiki. <laughs> Let me see if I can show y'all this clown's picture. We got this dude. We gotta see. Y'all keep talking about Kiki while I get this motherfucker. Hey, up here. That's so yeah, you, you see the fight in Disney World? Oh my God, that was—I oh, hate that. I was so heated, man. I'm like, yo, these two dudes going at each other, but they barely what going happened? at each other. But he are going hard on the women. Dude, what happened? That dude beat the hell out of his girlfriend. Let me beat his girlfriend. Yeah, he beat. Uh, I don't know what she said, but she won't say it again. No, some <laughs> other girl. Some other girl said. She was the one that did something to his mother when his mother fell. Right. They what say I, she. He tried to say she did. Then he started going off on her. But I'm like, yo, why you ain't go that hard on that dude? The dude when be you, bad. The dude when be you and the dude, when you and the dude squaring up on each other, why y'all didn't go that hard on each other? Y'all hitting women and shit. I can see that. What, and then all the, then all the passive aggressive men trying to break it up. I, I was like, that couldn't have been me. Not I'd have beat his ass. But be I, I would like that. First time I seen him hit a woman, I man, I would have beat yeah. the shit out of him. I Hold on, y'all. I gotta plug my bicep like that. Hey, hey, would you stop moving, bitch? You making my epilepsy flare up. Sit your fat ass. <laughs> <laughs> you little dick, you little nigga. Shut the fuck God, up. Damn, bitch, like, like, I need, I, like, I need my, I like, I need my men to ch- uh, chime in on that one. If you saw yeah, that video, it. man, I was, I was in here heated, that's man. That's the problem, man. The problem is we too busy videotaping shit and not helping. Right, that's, that's what I'm saying. I was like, who videotaping this the whole time? I'm like, he's sitting there hitting women like, and then he gonna say something about Crips. I was like, the Crips are very disappointed in you right now. Yeah, he you, if you're a real gang member, your who gang is very it? disappointed. Well, it was a fight between two dudes at Disneyland, and the one guy decided he wanted to beat up a fat girl. He knocked that fat girl out. Oh, they knocked, he knocked that bitch out. He gave that bitch a two ice cream scoop, nigga. Like, yeah. ha, knocked her out. And then his, I don't know if it was girlfriend or whatever, he and he started beating her up, started beating her ass, like beating her for real. 
Like they was hitting, they was hitting the women harder than and going hard at the women than they went at each other. When what? they when, it, when men squared up, they just dancing with each other like they in the no. fifth grade and shit. Man, Both of them was hitting women. Yeah, yeah. That big girl, that big girl, they they, they smell smelling sauce. They used the hot dog to wake up. She was like, yeah. <laughs> hot dog out her nose. One, one of them big turkey legs. That <laughs> big leg. what what turkey legs? Legs? I have the bags too, so I'll talk to you about that. Uh, you can get a bag from me. Sorry. Yeah, but no football. It was it was it was terrible. Like I think, and then the men, like you said, the way they broke that shit up, man. They should have they should have beat his right, ass. Right, right. They should have beat it. They it was embarrassing. Man. It was embarrassing to the whole black race. It really was embarrassing. Yeah. Very, very embarrassing. First of all, you hearing women like that, you know, and then it's just like you going hard at women. And then it was so funny. By the time the security got there, well, they called them the Disney ambassadors or so. It was like they were scared. My thing I is that. Somebody you know, like, what's up, Joe? Joe said they were fighting over, they was fighting over chicken nuggets. <laughs> My thing yeah. is, don't ever hit a woman. Head yeah, butter. <laughs> Are you serious, Charlie? <laughs> no chicken nuggets? No, I don't know what they fight though. That big girl, that big girl, I don't know what she was fighting up. That big girl got banged. They hit that big girl so hard. That bitch went to sleep. That yeah, it was, a, it was a it was a big girl and her husband, and they had babies like them. They had Baby. kids in strollers. Mm. And the first dude, the, the big girl husband, hit the other guy girlfriend. He caught up with like a, a like a right when they was all together. And then something happened when the mama tried to break it up, and the mama she got fell. knocked down, and the big girl knocked the mama down, and it, it was it was it was just crazy. But I was just very disappointed in the, in the way they acted. And then my I was just hurt at the way that the men didn't break it up, especially when they went at women. Now the two men going at each other, yeah, it looked like a schoolyard fight. Wow. Yeah, they they danced around. Right. I mean, what made me mad was how did they allow the guy to get to his girl with the girl, the other little small girl. Right, they have they enough time to stop that fight. Like mm. at that at that point, when he when he hit the women on the first time, it's like at that point, come on, dude, this this ridiculous. Mm. Like All this I got ridiculous. saying was that big girl could take a punch. That bitch could took that punch. She took that hit. <laughs> that big girl got strong face. You got strong face when you chew like this. <laughs> All these muscles strong. <laughs> that big girl was like, you ain't doing nothing to me. You ain't doing nothing to me. Timmy, you dumb. But yeah, but yeah. I, I, I don't yes, care if a man and hit a woman like that. I don't care if I'm on the streets. A man hit a woman, I'm whooping your ass. Right. I'm sorry. I, I that, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going for that. that that's that's crazy. You know, I can't. You know, people say that that could be your sister. Sometimes I wish it was my sister, though. Man, we don't get along. Sometimes, boy, <laughs> sometimes I think it's my sister. Like, but you, how you hit a woman with your fist closed like that and knock her out? Close fist. And you wouldn't hit the dude like that. That's what bothers me. Like no, they, 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 the dude beat his ass. The other dude grabbed him and started beating him and started hitting over the other. You got your ass beat by a man, so you hit a woman. Crazy. Mm. Wow. Mm. I can't wait to go to Disneyland to see the next fight. I'm putting better on that shit. That's I'm true. Disneyland. I mean, let me tell you though, it, it is so heartbreaking that you can't even go to Disneyland. You know what I'm saying? We can't, nigga. Can it, I mean, Disneyland's these trifling ass people. I don't know. Man. What's next, nigga? They so have a fight out, to totally embarrassing, Joe. Huh? What's this up, what's up, right Joe? Here. Mr. Joe Jackson. Who's that right there? That's the guy. This guy right here. Like, who's that? He is a voodoo hairdresser. So this dude. Oh, the voodoo dude. Let me tell you. According to the New Orleans Hello? Police Department. Hey, Del. Yo. Yeah, I don't see Nikki. She's sitting there frozen. I'm not frozen. Hey, everybody here. Listen, she, she looked like, look like she looked at a bag of dicks. Okay. <laughs> According to the New Orleans Police Department, 29 year old Enoch Azar. Yeah, I heard about this dude. You heard about that? The hair he cut from his customer at the old school barbershop and used it in black. For sexual favors and all types of other crazy stuff. Yes. He said, we found a voodoo altar in the store's basement with dozens of dolls. Also found bags yeah, you in the head, each mark with the name of the customer it came from. Mr. Azaka used his skills as a voodoo sorcerer to cause pain and illness in his victims in order to extort money and sexual favors. The victims described suffering from acute migraines, back pain, severe rashes, respiratory problems. And even some uh, sudden and eerie hemorrhages, 
that will cause blood to come out of their nose, ears, uh, eyes, and ears. Wow. wow. This doctor allegedly contacted them himself to explain okay. that he was a powerful sorcerer. Check that out. Wow. And cause of their pain. According to the New Orleans Police Department, Mr. Azaka used black magic rituals to cause curses on at least 48 of his customers. Enoch Azaka now faces a total of 184 criminal charges, including 94 charges of witchcraft. Wow. wow. No, 94, to, wait, 32 charges of extortion and 48 charges of witchcraft. If found guilty of the charges, he faces a fine of a million, over a million dollars, and 835 years in jail. Get to that shit. What the fuck do they even bother saying something like, you going to jail for 800 years? What's the point of that shit? This nigga's no, 835 years. That's just numbers. That's just numbers. But that's crazy. And yeah. can you imagine that they just had the Essence Festival down there? Do you know if they didn't catch him, how many Malaysian Chinese women be somewhere shaking? <laughs> no, no, I'm All that weave down there, he done got a hole too on Bourbon you know, Street. You know that shit. Well, he that, said that, that, he cut their hair. He cut ain't no black hair. women. Ain't no black women nowhere shaking. Cause no, all that Malaysian Egyptian. <laughs> <laughs> he called me. I don't know what the fuck you talking about, nigga. I don't hey, know. Hey, Nikki. What? That witchcraft don't work. That witchcraft don't work on nappy hair. All nappy hair been safe. You know, it does not. Unfortunately, so I'm here to tell you, Mister Anaka, get the fuck on with your bullshit. Yeah, that's okay. Crazy. He looked crazy. That's crazy. That is beyond bananas, man. Look at this motherfucker. He, <laughs> no, he fucking face. edges up. He fucking everything up. Look at his ass. Man. I tell you what, I'm not fucking with him. They believe in that shit here, man. And and part of what makes that black magic work is you got to believe that shit first. Right. Man. Yeah, you're right. You know, this clown, man, is running around here fucking people up with bullshit. Then he got calling him, just so you know, this is what I'm doing to you. <laughs> Nigga. Wow. Call me. I'll be like, hold on for a minute. You ain't got no hair. You ain't got nothing to worry about, boo. You straight. No. You straight. Mm -hmm. like, uh, I, 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 I shaped you up. You about to die. I'm not even getting no <laughs> shape up out of town, okay? I'm not doing shit. I'm going home to my barber who only smokes reefer. I ain't got to worry about that. <laughs> ain't, no, ain't no rituals going on. He's smoking weed. That's it. He just, he just forget how much he <laughs> He's going to start he calling you. Talking about, if you don't bring me a Twitter bag next time, I'm going to do something with this hair I got off the floor. <laughs> yeah. You're going to create Herman the Monster, nigga, because that's everybody's hair. <laughs> Man. Yeah. That is crazy, though. Can you imagine? Usually that kind of crazy shit be white people. Not Nola. It's Nola, baby. <laughs> it ain't no baby. joke out there, boy. New Orleans ain't no joke. Don't forget, y'all. Please like and share this feed. Just hit the share button. It don't cost you nothing to do it. Just share. Just share, share, share. We Tell need y'all to share. We're trying to get the sidewalk outside of Wendy Williams studio when she moved no, to California. We're trying to get a sponsor. We got hot Cheetos. They this close to the sponsor, hot Cheetos. <laughs> so y'all know Starbucks back at it again, right? No, I worked yeah, over so Starbucks. I didn't see that. So social media users are boycotting Starbucks because Starbucks, uh, after police officers were allegedly asked to leave an Arizona Starbucks. Let me tell you why. Hold on. I read the story. You did. Well, tell them why then, Timmy. It's because a customer in the store felt like they said they didn't feel safe with the police being in there. You know, they got a whole bunch of stuff going on with some... um. Some of murder, or some arrest, or some of some black person. And, yeah. and right now they on edge. So right now they asked them. They didn't feel the, the customer ain't feel safe. So they asked the police to leave. With five cops in there just having coffee. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so the problem, the problem with that is you ask them to leave, but when your ass get robbed, you want them to come back. Right. <laughs> That's the problem. I think it's stupid. Starbucks employees, and, and it must be like the people they're hiring. 
because some of this shit shouldn't even make the news because it shouldn't go past the manager. You right. know what I'm saying? Right. Like if I'm right. the manager and, and a customer comes to me with some silly shit like that, you know, I don't care if the police is white or black. Listen, these officers have every right to be here as you do. And on the reverse, these people, these customers are sitting here, even if they ain't buying nothing, they minding their fucking business. Shut the fuck up, eat your shit, or get the fuck on. Exactly. That's what I said. My point is, do you risk five police officers, that's probably five sales that you probably get every day for one sale? Even, even I don't risk no day. sales. And so see, it ain't even about five it. or one or none of that shit. Right. It's what I'm common is, sense. It's right. common what I'm saying sense. Is, from a business standpoint, fuck that person. If you want to leave, leave. I'm not asking five people to leave. I'm not you asking nobody to leave. leave because exactly. you are so being sick. Saying. It's right. not even five or one. If it's one person or five people, you leave motherfuckers alone. Right. I, exactly. I see what you say. I see what you're saying, though, Timmy. Compare five to, to the average no, of one. If you feel like uncomfortable, why should the five leave when I can have five cups of coffee sold to your one cup of coffee? No, you exactly. go get, you go you go to Caribou or whatever, Dunkin' Donuts or whatever, and get your coffee, and these five gonna stay here and drink this coffee. So I wonder how much money Starbucks and other businesses like that have to put out. Every year because of dumbass employees. A lot. A lot. It's crazy. A lot. The only, the only, the only, the only, place, the only place that probably don't have that problem with putting out a lot of money is um Chick-fil-A. Oh no, said police don't pay. They, yeah, they do. In Starbucks, we pay, honey. We we pay. Don't Royal Farms, we don't pay. I know. Don't tell me I know. <laughs> I know all the free shit at. <laughs> don't, don't, don't pay. And fuck uh uh Starbucks, I mean, that's about Royal Farms. We ain't had to pay for coffee. Well, you paying in Starbucks? Oh, I thought you had to pay for that. I said, Don't tell people you ain't got to pay at Royal Farms. They're gonna be oh, like, no. Hey, Timmy, go give me a three piece. No, no, Timmy, no, give me a three piece. Give me two wings and a biscuit, Tim. <laughs> he worked he there. Said, he worked there. It was five. The officer worked there. He wasn't a customer. Who worked there? It was five. But it was five cops there, though. Mm. It was five. So all of them didn't work there. And I he, just even think the it's he, extra. He, People need to learn how to allow other Mind people to exist without fucking with them. You know, yep. I, I read a story yesterday about a darn baby. Uh, uh, so a little baby was crying, screaming to his dad not to call the police on this black guy for just being outside. Wow. Silly shit. Wow. People well, I, was in, I, was in, I was in, I was in, I was in Sand Club. You know, you put the water under the bottom. Some yeah. white lady had in there. She had to tell me, don't forget your ward at the bottom. I was like, look here, bitch. I'm trying to steal it. You all in my fucking business. <laughs> <laughs> now I had to put on the belt because this bitch reminded everybody I had water under there. <laughs> oh, she said the guy that complained worked there. Okay. Uh -huh. It don't make a I difference. Think, I think that it doesn't. It's, it's silly, man. People got to stop. It's silly. shit. That's even yeah, worse. Yeah, but like I said that's again, even, that's that's even worse. You're an employee. But hey, Reverend, you, you, you call oh. police back, right? So oh, the guy back. was white. He was white. Of course. Oh, okay. okay. I know white people. White people, white people, white people are some nosy motherfuckers. Hey, did you know you have a tail out? You know you get a ticket for that. Bitch, I had a tail out for two years, bitch. Hey, 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 you, hey. She was like, she was like. You know you have water under your car. Don't forget your water. Like, this is messed up my stealing plan. I steal water all the time. Did you level. tell her that? You should have told her that. <laughs> you should have told her that. You should have said, mind your business. Mind mind your business. <laughs> Bitch, I know I got water. Don't you say I need this water? <laughs> Hold up. This is water for my wife's lifesaver vibrator. Shut up. Like I said, I ain't gonna lie to you. But they do, my, they always gotta remind you when they see shit. Why I love it. They do that. Like, always gotta remind you of shit. Hey, hey, you know your seatbelt is not on. Yeah. Your oh, did, speaking of like the water thing, did y'all see the um video of the old lady with her grandkids coming out of Kmart? They load up the car and the white people pull up behind her talking about he stole the um scooter. He need to take that back in the store. No, I don't no. see that. But the grandmama, the grandmama didn't know he took it. 
So she thought everything she had in the car she paid for. Right. So they like, no, he need to take that back. Grandma said, you don't get the hell away from my car and leave me and my grandbabies alone. You know what I'm saying? And the whole time, they just, no, no, he need to take. Then, and then they finally broke the little boy down. You know what I'm saying? So he stole a scooter? I think he did take it out of the store. What kind of school? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That nigga need to go to jail. Fuck just, him. just, just a little. <laughs> just, just a little school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, that nigga, a little thing. Like, like a I, school nigga, they, I, Yeah, he they they was in the parking lot getting ready to leave. They done, he done made it. The white people rolled up it. behind the car. They following niggas home. He ain't make it. <laughs> Shit. He better be careful and make sure. Look, uh, we know white people knows it. You know, look, look at the look, look, look at the proof. Trayvon Martin, that is yeah. the, that is the testament of, you know what I'm saying? White people minding people's business. This dude got killed because of people minding, minding this guy's business. You know what I'm saying? Mind this kid's business, minding his business. Mm. You know what I'm saying? That's the biggest example you can get right there. It's crazy. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Grandma was smooth with it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Grandma knew that shit. <laughs> I yeah, got the seat right it. here. I done paid for everything. Yeah, y'all get the, y'all get away from my truck. <laughs> Oh, the school okay, is so, Mind school your fucking you business. Right. <laughs> Y'all stop that stealing, shit. man. They killing motherfuckers over stealing. Listen, people, do what's right. Hey, Nikki, please stop putting that radioactive ass bracelet up to the goddamn thing. You better get cancer. <laughs> Put that big you ass. You know what? On. And and that's that. You you right about that because um, I just learned yesterday. I bought these at Essence Fest, and I forgot that fast. That I can't wear these because over time they make you sick because of the aluminum. Right, right. Aluminum foil. You keep, that's why. <laughs> I thought, <laughs> I thought, a, that, was for, I thought that was from the car. I thought that like controlled the rattles. I can't let it touch my skin. Okay. It's gorgeous though, right? Very nice. Uh, no, this shit like a big, a, a balled up piece of homework. It's like a school project. <laughs> Some shit you take your child. You did a good job. She didn't leave them. What the fuck is this? <laughs> I hate you. It look like you're trying to be a Grace Jones impersonator. <laughs> Slave to the rhythm. No. <laughs> Slave to the rhythm. Take a clothes off. Or take a clothes off. Take a clothes off. That's it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yep, she right. We talking talking about Zimmer shit. Zimmerman got off. That's exactly what I was talking about. The big that's the biggest example you can have. Right. So. That's why they do it. That's what she's saying. She's saying they do it because he got yeah. off. Yep. Man. Yeah. All right, y'all. It's time to wrap up. What's going on this week? Uh, I'll be at Martini's on Friday, uh, getting shot at. I mean, doing the show. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be there with you, Lord Timmy. So it's no no show tomorrow, guys. We'll be back on Thursday with our usual. It's too early for this shit schedule because I will be on the road. I'll be in the air coming home. I'm so ready to be home. And uh, Thursday, me, Lil Timmy, Big Dale, all back together again. 1030. 1030. 1030. Y'all the most unprepared, prepared show ever. I'll be, in, I'll be I'll be I'll be in ATL Friday. I won't be able to see the show, Tim. I gotta take my daughter down the clock for orientation. Oh, thank you. Tell your daughter congratulations, man. She's doing so much better than her father. Thank you so much. <laughs> she has goals, she has goals and expectations. She has goals, right? She got hopes and dreams and shit. Yeah. Yeah, she not the, she not at the gym ordering pizza. <laughs> <laughs> I, on the, on the treadmill, uh, me, I just want a yeah. little four. <laughs> what? Four low calorie, ain't it? <laughs> <laughs> Y'all stupid. All right, babe. Bomb and weave. All right, Timmy. Little right. Timmy. I love you. Right. I miss you. Love you too, honey. Be safe, travel. Safe travels, honey. Yes, Big be safe. Be safe. Be safe. Okay, Remember, baby. we love y'all. Before, like you you final, before you do the final thought, I just want to remind everybody that July 18, please show up City Winery. Go to citywinery.com right now. Get a ticket. Give it away if you can't make it, but support Black comedy. We need to keep growing underground comedy in D.C. Is so many phenomenally funny comedians. Not Timmy, but it's a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm one of the best, boo. You know. <laughs> we want to keep bringing this to you at low cost. So $20, grab two tickets, give them to somebody, just show up. Man, make sure I'm you're there. Open. Make sure y'all there. I'm hosting. You want me to host, Nick? Y'all host. Yeah, Lil Timmy is hosting. And then on uh, the 30th of next month, he'll be headlining. So, go. Yes. Big Dale, yes. give us the final thoughts for the day. Hey, 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 man, it's just amazing to be back here. Amazing to see such beautiful people join us on the feed today, man. Remember, it's beautiful. It's nice out wherever you are. Even if it's raining, it's still nice out because your eyes opened up this morning. You were able to see it. Remember, be great. Be amazing. Be who you are. Go get whatever is meant for you to get. And do me a favor. Don't look at the bracelet. Don't look <laughs> at the bracelet. <laughs> All right, y'all. We out of here. Cause love we y'all. Like and share. Share. Do a watch like party. Show it again later, man. We love y'all. It's too early for this, for this shit. shit. Love you, Big D. Hi. Right, see you later, nigga. Be good. Be safe. Okay.